It was an emotional plea for police actions to be addressed when the relatives of Shaquille Grant picketed the police headquarters at Evlery this morning. Grant was killed by police the day before he turned 18 years. His sister was on the picket line this morning. My brother was an innocent young man and everyone that knows my brother that knows Chargy can tell you. Chargy is not a thief. Chargy is not a criminal. Chargy never passed through the court. And police actually had the audacity to stand over my brother and shoot him. And them asking if he ain't dead yet. I'll tell me in God's good name what the police really try to do to people by children. The police action has been justified with statements by the Guyana police force that the men fired at the ranks and that they were planning a robbery. They claim they found a gun. Present your facts that you find a gun. Present your facts when police find stuff like that, this be in the papers. Why is it it's not in the papers? Come on. You ain't got no records. You ain't got no facts to prove that this child is a criminal. You cannot assume somebody's conversation. Now you could tell people that they were planning a crime. You didn't hear that. You Georgie Shaquille Grant is innocent. You and Georgie never make headline for no thief and story, no murder. He made papers, yes, for what? Football. He's about, he would have been about to be enlisted at GDF. Oh, tell me in God's good name. Why is it he could do them like this so they could stand over him and murder him like that? Grant's aunt used the occasion to call on the Minister of Home Affairs, Clement Roy, to act. These police have just got this government looking bad. It's high the Clement Roy step down. How we give you some sort of justice for Sharky Grant? You understand me? Bro, I nobody come out and give no, no press conference, no statement, nothing. Judge is not an animal. He come from a mother. A mother home right now hollering for her 17-year-old. Oh, Look, Mr. Clement Roy, you shake this young man a few months back. I was there the opening. I spoke to him. He began to do something for the youths in Agricola. And then a few months after, I just gone down Shaki. This morning, residents told the media that the police continued to intimidate residents of Agricola. They said that the police officers attempted to stop a wake last night and chased people off the streets. Last night, tires were lit on the East Bank, the Marara Public Road, as residents protested the death of the teen. For Prime News, Nazima Ragaber.